Hello and welcome back to another lecture. In the last lecture, we opened a new AWS account and we signed into that account with our root user's credentials. In this lecture, we will enable multi-factor authentication for our root user's account to add extra layer of security. Please remember that your root user has access to everything in your AWS account. That's why we are adding multi-factor authentication for that root user account to add an extra layer of security. To enable multi-factor authentication for your root user, first sign in into your AWS account as the root user. Then once you sign in, you see up here where your account name is, select the drop down and select my security credentials. And it is going to bring you to this page. On this page, select multi-factor authentication here and click activate MFA. For this option, you are going to choose the type of MFA device you want to assign. We are going to use an app authenticator. So select the first one and click continue. Then it should bring you to this page. The next thing you are going to do now is go to your app store on your phone and type Google Authenticator. Once you find the Google Authenticator app, download it. Once you have downloaded the Google Authenticator app, open it. Then we are going to click Get Started and you are going to click Scan a QR code. It is going to ask you for access to your camera, click OK. The next thing you are going to do in the AWS Management Console is click Show QR Code. Then use the camera on the Google Authenticator app to scan the QR code. You should see some numbers pop up on the screen. We are going to enter those numbers down here. The first number I see on my screen is 581054. After some time, the numbers will change. So we'll wait for this to time out and the number is going to change and we are going to enter the next number in the second MFA code. So I'll give it some time for that number to change. And the number has changed. The second code is 620762. Then click assign MFA. And this is how we enable multi-factor authentication for our root account. So anytime we want to sign in into the AWS Management Console with the root user's credentials, there's going to be that extra layer of security where once you enter your password, it is going to ask you for the code that pops up in the app authenticator. So let's test that. We are going to sign out of this account. In your account, sign out as the root user. Then let's log back in. We are going to click log back in. We are going to sign in as the root user and enter your email in here. Once you enter your email, click next. And again, for security check, you have to enter the letters and numbers you see here. I'll enter it. And click submit. And now you are going to enter your password. And there you go. Once you enter your password, it is asking you for multi-factor authentication. So now you have to open the Google Authenticator and enter any code you see in there presently in this box. So I'm going to open the Google Authenticator app again. And in my Google Authenticator app, I'll wait for the code to change. And the new code I'm seeing in there is 638108. Once I enter that code, I'll click submit. And there you go. This is how we enable multi-factor authentication on our root account. So moving forward, anytime you want to log in into this root account, it is going to ask you for the multi-factor authenticator code. Thank you. And I'll see you in the next lecture. Bye.